Hey you guys, this is Black and Blue and I don't know about you, but I'm ready to get into this prop money changeover from my real money video. <laughs> Let's go. This is Black and Blue, go ahead. What's the crime? An attempt to watch and not subscribe? Yep, that's a crime. If you're here, you're going to enjoy this video, so go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Friends don't let friends watch and not subscribe. So, <laughs> come on, let's get into the video. Okay, so, you guys. So, I am going to be switching out the money in these envelopes into prop money so right now there's over fifty five hundred dollars in these envelopes and that is way too much money so correction i'm not switching out this money this is my weekly binder and i am going to be not unstuffing that one with prop money because i use it throughout the weeks this is going to be my sinking funds binder this is the money that I am saving up for various reasons that are listed on these envelopes. If you're not into budgeting, stuffing cash, check it out. Watch some videos. There's some really good channels. Cash Me in Paradise, Budget by the Bag, Hands and Bands. There's also Kathy's Cash and Coin. You guys, check out those videos. I will, I'm sure I popped them up somewhere around here when I just said them. But check out those channels, you guys. If you're not into stuffing, they are amazing at explaining it. They're at ex they're amazing at saving. It's motivating. And you guys, if you if you don't save, do it. If you're wondering why are we using prop money today? Why is there prop money in this video? You're gonna see why. This binder has so much money in it, and I don't like it sitting in my home. I've got a safe. I've got guns, but. When a fire happens, what am I supposed to do with, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> it's scary. So we've got real money in here. We've got prop money in here. I like to use prop money because it helps motivate me to see what I have saved, what I'm saving. Um, when my money goes to the bank, I don't see it anymore. I mean, I can get online. I'm not really a tech savvy person, so I can get on my online banking and see it. But budgeting and knowing what I can spend in each category that is what helps me so if you need help and you're not sure how to start see if this works for you it's fun it's super fun otherwise why would you be here you know it's fun <laughs> okay so i'm gonna go ahead and pull out my tray my crusty dusty tray okay in here which i ordered this from conquer vinyls if you guys never heard of her and her instagram and her store check her out. I'm going to put her Instagram tag right here. <laughs> Go check it out because she can make anything for you. Aprons, um, bags, purses, anything that you want. She can put anything you want on it. I'm in love. I'm going to have her do so many other things. Hoodies. I want shirts. I've got all kinds of different ideas, but we're going to go ahead and pull this money out. I don't use, I don't stuff any prop money other than $100 bills. So we're going to get those out. All this other money is kind of just, I ordered it. I did an unboxing if you guys want to see that. It's super fun to play with, so I'm keeping this. <laughs> All right, so we've got hundreds. I'm also going to pull out, is it in this one? Yes, I'm going to go ahead and pull out these thousand dollar slips that oh my gosh hands and bands have you guys seen her channel if you haven't go check her out i'm gonna put her channel down here as well because she's awesome she's a teacher she has an etsy store where i purchased my first ever challenge and it's the challenges for helping you save money it's really cool so check that video out because that should be posted already oh my gosh so she made these for me and i love them these are called placeholders they are $1,000 placeholders, so when you save up to $1,000 in one of your envelopes, you can switch that 1000 out for one of these slips. It makes it easier and faster for counting. I love these. It makes it easier for counting, and it's kind of it's kind of like a, um, like a milestone. You hit that 1000 and you're like, yes, I get to use this $1,000 slip. That's me anyways. So she put my name on three of them. I love this. This is a $100 slip. I'm actually going to put this over here. 
but I've got $5,000 slips. So let's see which lucky envelopes get a $1,000 slip. Starting off with black and blue. This is my savings envelope. I'm going to actually move this to the side so that I can count more efficiently. All right, so we've got prop money in here. I'm going to move the prop money here, and then we've got the real money. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to swap out. Hmm, should I do the 100 swap? Yeah, let's do 100 swaps first. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1,000. I honestly don't know if I even have. Yeah, I should, yeah. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. You guys, I'm I love counting this. This is pretty close to counting real money. It's not exact by any means, but it's pretty close. I have a blast with counting this, and I'm addicted to counting money. So if this works for me, it could work for you. So we've got the real money. We're switching over to the bank, and then I'm switching this prop money to take its place. That's added to, and this is taken away. What do I have left? I've got 20, 45, 55, 65, 70. So that's going to stay. And then let's see how many thousand dollar slips we can switch out for this. This money is already in the bank. The real money's in the bank. So switching these out for thousand dollar slips is just going to help me when it comes to reusing and recycling my hundred dollar bills. All right, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, actually three thousand. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, four thousand. And then I've got two hundred left. So that was fast. We got one, two, three, and four. So we have one left awesome i'm gonna need some more so these four thousand dollar slips is going into the envelope and these are getting recycled back which is great because then i don't have to buy more of these and someone gave me that great idea i want to say it was hands and bands that possibly gave me that great idea she's full of great ideas <laughs> so we have one, two, three, four thousand, one hundred, two, three hundred, twenty, forty, five, fifty, five, sixty, five, seventy. Cool. So we got four thousand three hundred and seventy dollars in savings. And the only amount of real money I have in this envelope right now is seventy dollars. You guys, can you imagine? Compare. If I had seven hundred seven hundred dollars in this, or wait, seven sorry, seventy dollars in this versus four thousand and two hundred dollars that's this is nuts you guys if i lost this envelope with five dollars in it i'm gonna have a heart attack so you could imagine moving on moving on let's see what we got here looks like we have a lot coming out which is what i like to see okay so i'm gonna put this here let's straighten this out a little bit okay so I don't like to count with having a bunch in my hand at one time. It doesn't feel comfortable. So we will start with the real money. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000. Awesome. So this is 1,000. I'm gonna go ahead and place this right here and then I'm gonna need 1,000. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000. All right, perfect. So our emergency fund, I hope I didn't call it savings again. This is our emergency fund. How much do I have left in cash? 20, 40, 65, 75, 82, 83. So not quite 100. So I only have $1,000 slip left. I need to order some more. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000. So I'm gonna go ahead and replace this with the motion money, which looks way too real and I need to figure out a solution for that. It looks so real. Okay, so we got 1,000. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, three thousand. One, two, three hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, five, seventy five, eighty two, eighty three. So three thousand three hundred and eighty three dollars. Awesome. So we don't have any more one thousand dollar slips, so I won't be able to stuff that. However, I will go ahead and replace any hundreds that need to be replaced as well. And then we can figure out the thousand dollar slips on the next go around. All right, home. Let's see what home is working with. We have the prop money here. And then we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. So I'm gonna put this over to the bank and then I am gonna grab $200 bills. This is so fun. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand, one, two hundred, twenty, thirty, forty-five. One thousand two hundred and forty-five dollars in home. And I do want to build I do want to build a new home, so that's what this is for. Holidays are coming up, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. One, two, three hundred. We're leaving this the prop money to the side. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. I'm gonna put the 200 to the side and grab out 200 prop bills. All right. So how much is in holidays for us to spend? One, two, three, four, five hundred, twenty, forty, sixty. Five hundred and sixty dollars. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna use all of that this year for Christmas because this goes for birthdays, decorations, Christmas, all of that. But I don't, I'm definitely not going to be spending that much for Christmas because it's my daughter. I only buy Christmas gifts for my daughter, um, for kids, basically. Not just my daughter, but for kids. Okay, and if you hear a cute little noise, that's my dog. He's dreaming. Oh my God, listen. <laughs> I wish I could take my camera down and show you guys. Oh my gosh, he sounds so cute. He sounds so cute. sounds adorable right now okay i have a little yorkie and he when he dreams he sounds like a little whistle it's so funny okay we're gonna move the prop money to the side let's see what we have in real money remember 100s are the only things i use as prop money so everything else you see is real money what uh 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 20 40 60 83 20 40 60 80 400 so 400 I'm putting into the bank and I will take out $400 worth in prop money. All right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1,000. You guys see how many $1,000 slips I need? That's a blessing. Um, this is, and this is my daughter's account or my daughter's envelope. So 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 600, 20, 35, 45, 55. Wow. 1,645 dollars. Good job, girlfriend. She's making her way downtown. I'm just kidding. She's making her way um, to $2,000, which is awesome. Okay, college money. This is April's college, not mine. I'm gonna go ahead and put these to the side. And then let's see what we have. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400. Again, I'm gonna put the 400 to the side that's going back to the bank. And then I am grabbing $400 worth of prop money. Okay. 
All right. Let's see how much is in college for her. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. One, two, three, four, five hundred. Ten, twenty five, thirty five, forty five. So, what was that? $545. So, $1,545. Not bad. Not too shabby. I foresee her getting scholarships and all of that. So, if that's the case, then this college money can go towards laptop. It can go towards, you know, other things. Vacay. What do we have in vacation? I feel like I don't make this much of a priority, but... If you want to know why, that's honestly it's in a last, last video. So, we're going to put the prop money to the side. 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. We made it. We made it. $200 prop money. And this is going to the bank. Perfect. So, we have in vacay, which we go to the Wisconsin Dells every year. We attempt to in the summer. It's such a such a fun place to go, especially when you have kids. One, two, three, four, five hundred and five ten. Five hundred and ten dollars. I care most about the hotel. So that's really what this is going towards is our hotel stay. All right. Next up. What is this? Mortgage? No. What is this? Do I put my mortgage in here? Houston, I'm confused. What is this for? This should not be my mortgage. What is in here? If this is my mortgage, it's supposed to be in my other envelope. So let's see what's in here. 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. 20, 40, 60, 84. 20, 40, 60, 85. 20, 40, 60, 80, 600. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 50. Yeah, this is my mortgage. I can tell based on the amount that's here, $750. So that doesn't belong in here. I don't know why I put that in here. All right, my mortgage belongs in this envelope. Stickers, black and blue, YouTube, and I... I'm going to go ahead and, you know, I'm just going to make bank that. We're going to the bank. We're going to make the bank my mortgage. I don't actually have an envelope that says mortgage. That's why it gets confusing, I think. But my mortgage goes in my weekly use binder, not my sinking funds save for a long time binder. Okay, binders are feeling a lot thinner. This is much better, you guys. This was... It was not looking so good. This is my challenge envelope also, if you guys like it. I got this one from Conqueror Vinyls as well. She made this one so beautifully. It's beautiful, black and blue. My channel, it's got the handcuffs, the money symbols, a gun, a radio, a baton, and my badge, which is so cool. And then I just love this. Did you notice? Can you notice? Did you notice? I love this symbol a lot. Do I own a Chanel bag? <laughs> no. Not yet, but, but I never will unless it's a gift. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and see. This is what we have. Now, these are the bills that I got to trade out. These are the prop money bills. So oh, much more than I, we started with. So this is the prop money. I'm going to go ahead and put this away. I think I'm going to use a stamp on those $100 bills. I just want to order a really cute stamp. So i got to find a good one. I got this one. Look at this. But it's not the one I want to use. How cool is that? I was about to stamp this real one. It looks like this. Oh, crap. Oh, this doesn't show up good. This is like that waterproof style um, post-it note. It doesn't show up very well on that. But I want to. I want to get a really cool one. Maybe one that says like black and blue. 
<laughs> okay, so this is all the real money. So let's see what we're taking back to the bank because I am really curious. I'm gonna go ahead and move my tray out the way. Okay, let's see what we're taking back to the bank. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. And this is how much money would be sitting in my binder right now if I didn't switch out what I could. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 81, 2000 now. 2000. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 83,000. Okay, so we got 3,000, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84. Perfect. So we have $3,400 that's going back to the bank and out of my binders, which I am very happy about. Perfect. Okay, that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think. This is technically my second video. Mm, is it my first or my second? This is, no, this is my first. This is my first time actually switching, doing like a switch over after getting paid. So let me know what you think about me switching over to the prop money and kind of how this video worked. I'm really curious to hear if there any anything you guys um, may think or any ideas you might have or what I could change if this something about this wasn't the way you were expecting or what you think might work better for me because I'm always here for improvements. I'm always here for criticism and I take it with, you know, a light heart. So comment down below if you have anything to say. <laughs> And I will catch you. Uh, I will catch you guys on the next video. Like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Bye, guys. I'm 108.